Good morning, how are you? I am getting dressed and stuff. I dropped Dave off at work this morning. So we left here around 7.30 and it is currently nine ish i'm fighting off going back to sleep because i am really good at just going back to sleep when i get back here and i have a lot of things that i want to do today so i cannot sleep because i work a double tomorrow so i won't be able to do anything at all tomorrow i'm listening to spotify right now and i have it hooked up from my phone to this little wireless speaker and it's put behind my TV right here. And Mulligan is absolutely petrified of it. He just can't handle the disembodied voices, I think. So I'm gonna put on some makeup. I'm going to go into town. I need to go to the bank and I need to go to Walmart today. So I need to go buy some stuff for a video on my collab channel, which I don't feel like I talk about a lot on this channel. I don't talk about my collab channel a lot, mostly because when it first started, it was something that was all mine and I really, really needed it at that point to be all mine. So I guess I just don't really tell people about it. I don't know. It doesn't have to be that way anymore I'm not in that space, but I do have a collab channel I'll put a little link right here to that channel if that's something that you want to go check out So for our collab channel, we usually have weekly themes and this week We're gonna build a box and send them to each other and this was my idea Sam make sure you follow through and Katie Rebecca who's also a part of that channel she just posted her video of her little send away box and I feel like such a flompy fail human so that's I'm gonna go do it today I have bumped that up my list we'll be doing that today it's just the right thing to do I got coffee going over here I got the kettle which Dave hates when I call it a teapot. I have the kettle on the stove right now. I'll use the French press, get some coffee. <gasps> have I turned down the disembodied human voice enough for you? Hi, handsome. It be be. I'm gonna turn the music back up so he's gonna go run and hide in the bathroom again. Butter, I, go hotter in the nick of time. I like Taylor Swift's new song. I've progressively liked Taylor Swift more and more, but there was this thing online that I didn't feel like I agreed with. I feel like I should set you down to talk to you about this. So I saw this thing on Twitter because I was scrolling through Twitter last night because I couldn't fall asleep, you know, like one does. I came across this post that said, there are two main ways to respond to trauma. You can be Kesha or Taylor Swift. You can be angry, vow to get revenge, and continue to hurt. Or you can move on and hope that people that hurt you someday find peace. I don't know about you, but I'd rather be Kesha. Here's my problem with that. There are two ways to respond to trauma. Is either one of them doing it wrong? No, not in particular. I think that Kesha, I went to Kesha's concert last year with Molly, and there was definitely some frustration and hurt because that was before she was able to release new music so she was still very frustrated tell me that anger does not come out of that and there was constant parts of like F them we're gonna be able to do this I'm gonna be able to release new music to you guys there is still anger in that just because Kesha is further along to a point where she can find peace in herself and say you know what yeah you hurt me I hope that you can figure out your own and move on and do life. So I think that just pitting these two people with trauma against each other is just not cool internet. But that's my little two cents in on that. I think that Kesha got to do her hurt revenge part and now she's at the finding peace which is a journey not an end point for anyone who's gone through that kind of trauma that's not like a oh well I'm all better now I'm gonna find peace no there's gonna be cycles of day where you feel angry and you feel upset and then you find peace and then you hope that they figure out their shit like that it's a cycle it's a journey and there's not an end point there's not a Taylor Swift is doing it wrong and Kesha is doing it right they're just at different points of a similar journey rant over my coffee is steeping right there. I came in this building because I wanted to come to the main main store and then I just spent the last 15 minutes trying to find a bathroom only to find this sign on the door. Are you kidding me? This can't be the only bathroom in this freaking building. Did I mention that I walked up to the third floor to find out that the bathroom was out of order? Well, I guess I'll go into the main main store having to pee like a racehorse. That's fine. 
I completely forgot to stop at the bank during that whole outing. Whoops, I don't know what to say about that. I forgot to go to the bank. I mean, it's not a big deal. I'll live, it'll be fine. So now I'm gonna take everything that I bought. I'm gonna divvy it up. I ended up in the main main store and everything is kind of expensive, but I don't care. I went through and bought some stuff. I'm excited with what I got. I'm about to share it online. I'm about to record the video explaining what I got and all this other things, but I'm also right at this moment going to finish up a blog post because if you didn't know I'm trying to do like a little blog thing about us traveling and going wherever we end up going and I have little space down below where you can go check that out if you'd like I'm gonna talk about getting a storage unit which if you've been watching my vlogs you already know that we got so I'm just gonna add some pictures onto that okay the mail just came and I'm really excited I know what it is but I'm gonna open it in front of you anyway because there is something that I want to try in this. Actually, there are two things I want to try that's in the box. I literally met the post guy at my door and just went, hi, thanks. Just took it right out of his hands. Most of the box is just this. And here are like two things. Look what I got. I got the shower shake, which is actually really the only thing I think from Zoella Beauty that I want to try. Smells like soap. That's soap all right. Excited to try that. And I got a lip thing from NYX, NYX, whatever it's called. I have no idea what this color is gonna look like. Someone had recommended the NYX lingerie to me and I just picked a color offline, but I'm not sure how it's gonna look or if I'm gonna like it at all. Ooh, that's pretty dark. My lips are also incredibly dry. I don't mind it. I don't, I wouldn't wear it with this probably and I'd probably do a different thing with my eye makeup, but I don't mind it as a color. But I feel like I could wear this. Let me know what you guys think. I don't usually go this color. I don't, don't usually go this way. I kind of like it. Not with this outfit, but I kind of like it. I need to get back to editing because that's what I need to do. But I'm going to put this shower shake in my shower. I'm excited to give this a try. Because why not? Internet hype, man. Wait a minute. The trees are starting to change, guys. The trees. Look to the trees. I'm leaving for my parents a lot later than I was planning for but I was really busy. It's not like I was just sitting around not doing anything. I was actually getting stuff done and I feel really, really productive today. I feel good about it. I just know that I'm gonna be at my parents pretty late doing the laundry, which I'm not very excited for because I work a very long double tomorrow because I'm also closing. But you know, we'll just call tomorrow a nothing day because my brain is just gonna be all on work. I've made it to my parents' house, but neither of them are here right now. So I've got a load of laundry started. I've given both of the dogs carrots because they were going absolutely insane. Like so, so loud. But I've got to be honest with you guys. I don't know how many more vlogs Captain's going to make it in. He is so old and his body's not working right anymore. And when I came in, he doesn't know it, but he just pees everywhere. And his legs give out on him all the time. He has that really bad skin condition and my parents may have to put him down before winter comes because it's just gonna be too hard for him to get through the winter as it is. His body is failing him, but his mind is fine. So let's just visit with him a little bit. So, hi, bud. And this little princess dog got a new bandana, but can I be honest with you? Can I be honest with you? It's not that slimming, you little sausage pooch. <laughs> Have you learned to sing from Captain? Stop it! Stop! You guys! You guys! What? Stop! Oh, you attention whores! Look at this little beauty, getting some sun, getting some last bit of sun, aren't you? Oh, cutie pie, little cutie pie. I just finished up all of my laundry and I'm gonna get out of here pretty soon. I've been watching lots and lots of episodes of Ink Masters season nine. I absolutely love Ink Masters. I could pretty much pick up any season, don't care what part of the season it is and just watch it. Don't care, I love Ink Masters. But I think something just, just switched over. I think my mom has something recording because she's camping right now, she's not here. Dad's here though, we've been hanging out, snacking and stuff. But Forged in Fire just came on, which is like, 
Ink Masters but with weaponry apparently and when they ask you to leave they say surrender your weapon which is so badass but I'm not gonna watch this because my laundry's done I'm gonna head back it's nine o'clock which is sooner than I thought was gonna be cool goodbye baby girl goodbye sweet baby you're adorable Yes, you. I stole Dave. I have him. Not that you can see him right now because he's under all the blankets. <laughs> but we are going to go to sleep because he's had a long day and I've been productive. So it's time we reward ourselves with some sleep. So thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you made it this far. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you next time.